today we're going to split the measures. This is an exercise, and I'll be working out of A. I'll be using this uh, pretty much this first position minor A minor pentatonic scale. Okay, and the chords will be uh, a measure of A5. One, two, three, four. A measure of C5. Three, four. A measure of D5. Two, three, four. A measure of A. Three, four. So it's a four bar measure. And in between, you throw in some riffs. This is called splitting the bar. So I'll give it the one beat. One, two, three. Okay, and then work out of the first position, then move up to some other positions. Uh, I'll give you a demo on that one. Okay, and what this does, this helps you develop some riffs and how to split the measure. How to play a chord, then play a riff, play a chord, and play a riff, play a chord, and play, play another riff. Especially if you're working on a three-piece, because, uh, you know, you have the bass player, he can't be expected to fill everything. So you try to help him out and play some chords and some riffs. And uh, that's about it for today. So, like I said, I'm working around with the first position. A5, C5, D5, A5. And you don't need a band to do this, so you can do this with the amplifier off. Like I said, you don't even need a gem track. You just sit there and practice it. Do it in different keys. And then come up with some other progressions. Some descending stuff. And, uh, you know, apply the same technique. Okay, that's it for today.